going on everyone? Fast Food Toy Reviews here. Today we have Transformers Bumblebee Cyberverse Adventures. Set of six cool looking toys released by McDonald's all the way back in 2020. Now this set was an import that I had shipped in all the way from Italy. Let's get them opened up and have a closer look. First up we have Autobot Grimlock looking cool. Let's give you a little spinneroo here. You can see the back is all hollow bits. But that's okay because you're not going to look at them from the back. You're going to see them from the front. And there's really not a whole lot going on with these toys other than this little gimmick right here. So you just spin this arm and the chest moves back and forth. Let's get an up-close look of that right there. So you can see as you turn his arm, it takes his chest and moves it back and forth. And it's got like a 3D lenticular card in there. And it looks like he's got like this power surge coming out of his chest. And then you bring it back and then you can see it's just normal and you get the little Autobot logo right there. So very simple stuff and this arm here moves. You can actually spin that all the way around. There's a little bit of wiggle in his head, spin at the waist and the legs are kind of fixed into place. Just a basic plastic mini figurine and a very simplistic gimmick going on. And that's it, about five inches tall, give or take. And uh, yeah, that's it. So there you go. It's Grimlock. The next one up is Megatron, leader of the Decepticons. Quick look at the back. Again, all the hollow bits. <laughs> well, you know, they're McDonald's toys. But, you know, if you're a Transformers guy, like I am, you'll appreciate it nonetheless. So, again, just like Grimlock, most of these are all the same. Here's the little gimmick. It's got the little 3D lenticular gimmick going on. So you wiggle this arm up and down. And it just swivels the chest back and forth. Got the little plastic window there so you can see in there. And, yeah, it's like a like an Energon energy burst coming out of their chest, like so. We'll kind of move it slow, give you a good idea of what we're doing here. And that's it. So this arm rotates around. You can see he's got his little cannon right here. And his head swivels back and forth. And a little bit of movement here. Actually, a complete 360 <laughs> at the waist. And, yeah, that's it. So there you go. It's, it's Megatron. Next we have Autobot Ratchet. Very cool looking. I like the red and the white. Very simple. So there's no stickers. There's nothing that comes with these. Just basic little mini plastic figurines. So you got the rotation here at the arm and then the little gimmick. We'll give you a look at that so you can see what's going on there. Again with the, the kind of cool 3D lenticular sticker or maybe a piece of cardboard in there. Whatever that is. <laughs> kind of switches back and forth. Kind of neat. Rotation at the head a little bit. Full 360 at the waist and the legs are fixed into place again they're all about the same size i would roughly say about five inches or so maybe five and a half inches just a quick comparison with grimlock just to give you an idea look at that there you go kind of nice so there you have it everybody it's autobot ratchet the next one up is starscream and he is a Decepticon, in case you didn't know anything about the Transformers. He's like Megatron's right-hand man, a very, very mean Decepticon Transformer. But this one actually looks kind of nice. I like the wings sticking out on the back. Let's see, do they move? Nope, no movement there. They're just kind of fixed in the place. You can see this kind of screwed in there. Okay, so, and there's a little bit of detail in there. And then this arm kind of spins up and down doesn't go all the way around because of the wing here but it does move and it's kind of kind of got it fixed out to the side right there so it's kind of awkward looking i don't know what to make of that but this arm here again same as the gimmick with the other ones you move the arm up and down and it gives it a different look so you got like the the nose cone of the jet you flip it back and it like you see the energon or energy coming out of there it's kind of neat and that's about it let's see swivel at the waist yep and there you go, everyone. It's Starscream. And here is Bumblebee, the next one up. Looking very nice. Hollow bits in the back. You can see he's got his door wing thing going on, fixed in position. A little swivel at the head, give you an up-close look of that. Very nice. Let's see, you can rotate the arms up and down here. Swivel at the waist. And the gimmick, just like all the others, is you got the little lenticular thing going on there. I, I like how you got the three different modes of the size of the Autobot symbol there. So as you move it back and forth, kind of like jets out there. That's actually kind of cool. I think that's the best one of the bunch so far. And I like this. This is kind of cool. And that's it. So there you go. It's Bumblebee. And last but not least is the leader of the Autobots. 
everybody's favorite, especially mine, Optimus Prime, the star of the show, if you ask me. So there's a look at the back. So he is a little bit taller than the rest, except for maybe Megatron. You can kind of stand them together. They look like they're about the same height. Maybe Optimus is a scooch taller, but he's definitely, let's see, let's, let's stand him next to Grimlock. Yep, this is a little bit taller. So he's the tallest of the bunch. And he looks really cool. I like the red and the blue. Very nice representation of the cartoon. So this arm spins all the way around. A little bit of head swivel. Full spin at the waist. And here is the gimmick. So you can see his windshield. And then it turns into like a big thing of energy bursting out of his chest. Which I think is just kind of neat. <laughs> I like the 3D lenticular gimmicks on some of these toys. It's really cool. And that's it, so there you go. It's Optimus Prime. And there you have it, everyone. Transformers Bumblebee Cyberverse Adventure Set of Six. Wonderful little toys. Released by McDonald's all the way back in 2020. Now, if you're a Transformers fan like me, you'll want this set. I will definitely be displaying this for my collection. It's worth it. I love Transformers. I love Optimus, Megatron, Bumblebee, all these things. Been a Transformers fan my whole life. And it just makes it a nice addition to any Happy Meal or Transformers collection. Thanks for watching, everybody. Take care. We'll see you again next time.